RSM FBNA non-contact bridge static and dynamic deflection tester on-site operation teaching video. One, device description. The RSM FBNA non-contact bridge static and dynamic deflection tester is mainly composed of three parts. The host, tripod, and control acquisition terminal. There are lens, charging socket, power switch, USB 3.0 data line interface on the host. It is also equipped with lens, rangefinder, the USB 3.0 male-to-male data cable, instrument charger, U-disc, small Phillips screwdriver, and other tools. RSM FBNA non-contact bridge static and dynamic deflection tester adopts the most advanced image quality evaluation algorithm, image quality enhancement algorithm, and fast camera self-calibration technology without any markers attached to the site. Only one host can realize real-time measurement of multi-point fast and high-precision dynamic and static deflection displacement, vibration, and other data of bridges, high towers, hoisting machinery, and other facilities. The instrument supporting software system has the functions of guided operation, automatic data recording, automatic calibration, intelligent point selection, real-time output, over-limit warning, and safety assessment. The integrated instrument design adopts military-grade sensors and connectors, and it is intuitive, simple, and easy to use on site. The standard rangefinder is 100 meters and 1500 meters. The standard lens has a focal length of 50 millimeters, and lenses with focal lengths of 16 millimeters, 25 millimeters, and 75 millimeters are optional. When the light is dim or the deflection measurement is performed at night, a target light can be selected as an auxiliary measurement point. The target light is equipped with a wireless remote control for use. 2. Applications This instrument is suitable for dynamic, static displacement detection of large facilities such as bridges, high towers, hoisting machinery, etc. It is also suitable for long-term monitoring of buildings, tunnels, dams, slopes, etc. Applicable Standards Load Test Methods of Highway Bridge Technical Code for Monitoring of Building and Bridge Structures Code for Urban Rail Transit Engineering Survey Code for Engineering Surveying the principle of this instrument is based on the pinhole imaging model using Digital Image Correlation Algorithm DIC, to measure the displacement of multiple target points on bridges, tunnels, hoisting machinery, high towers, and other large facilities in real time. Digital Image Correlation Algorithm is a non-contact optical calculation method based on digital image processing and numerical calculation analysis. The two-dimensional deformation of the surface of the object is measured by the two images before and after the deformation. With this method, the displacement and deformation fields of large facilities under load can be directly obtained without installing any sensors or marking points. 3. Operation Preparation 1. Find an open and unobstructed site near the structure to be tested, and choose the location of the instrument according to the measurement environment of the structure. 2. Take out the tripod and set it firmly in the selected position. 3. Take out the unit of the instrument and install it on a tripod. 4. According to the measurement conditions, select a lens with a suitable focal length. Unscrew the measuring front protective cover and lens protective cover of the host. Install the lens and tighten it. 5. Take out the USB 3.0 male-to-male data transmission line and use the USB 3.0 male-to-male data line to connect the instrument host and the pre-prepared laptop. 6. Double-click the RSM non-contact bridge static and dynamic deflection tester analysis software icon to enter the operating software interface. 
At the same time, turn on the power switch. 7. The operating software interface is divided into a menu bar, a toolbar, a quick setting bar for camera parameters, a real-time image display area, a status bar, a real-time curve display area, a measurement point data display area, and a pre-processing area. 4. On-site operation. 1. After entering the software interface, click New Project to set the project information. 2. Click the Open Camera button and the software will display the real-time image of the camera. Observe whether there is an instrument icon in the lower left corner of the camera screen. If not, click Turn off the camera. After reconnecting the USB 3.0 data cable, click Turn on the camera again. 3. Adjust the pitch and horizontal rotation of the tripod so that the measured object is in the middle of the camera screen. 4. Adjust the lens aperture and set the camera exposure time to avoid overexposure of the image. 5. Adjust the lens focal circle to make the image clearly displayed. And set the selected lens focal length in the camera parameter quick setting bar. 6. Click Add Measuring Point. Select a suitable point in the position which rich gray information of the measured object, such as the intersection of structural parts, rivets, marking points, etc., and click the left mouse button to complete the addition of a measuring point. If you need to add multiple measuring points, repeat this step. 7. After adding the measuring points, use the rangefinder to measure the distance between each measuring point and the instrument, and enter the obtained data into the distance column in the measurement point data display area. 8. Click Add Anti-Shake Point. Select a position with rich grayscale information in the area where the measured object is not deformed, and click the left mouse button to complete the addition of an anti-shake point. If you need to add multiple anti-shake points, repeat this step. 9. According to the measurement plan, set the data output interval and data warning value. If you need to change the sampling frequency of the rate, you can set it through the camera parameter quick setting bar. That is, before clicking the open camera button, click the camera parameter quick setting bar button, select the required sampling frequency, and then open the camera to complete the selection of high frequency sampling. 10. After completing the above steps, click to start measurement. The instrument enters the measurement state. 11. Click to stop measurement to end data sampling. 5. Interpret. 1. Click on data analysis to enter the main interface of data analysis. 2. Open the data file. 3. Perform power spectral density and data filtering analysis on the open data file, as well as calculation of impact coefficient and attenuation coefficient. 4. Exit the software. 6. Precautions. 1. When the RSM FBNA non-contact bridge static and dynamic deflection tester is operating, the ambient wind speed requirements are less than level 3, and the ambient temperature requirements are less than 40 degrees Celsius. 2. Try to avoid large vibration sources around the instrument during measurement. 3. The instrument should be set up in an open area as far as possible, and avoid obstruction as much as possible. 4. When the measuring instrument host is connected to the computer, the USB 3.0 mail-to-mail data cable must be installed in the USB 3.0 data transmission interface of the notebook computer, so as not to affect the normal operation of the measuring instrument due to interface limitations. Ooh.